this pair of 350Z seats and I want to make them look not as bad looking. Once clean, they can go in either this 280Z or that hard body. I'll take this bench seat back out again. It's got four bolts holding it in. line up. I'll look online see what kind of universal brackets I can find and get this installed instead of mocked up. But they certainly will look good in here. Yes, they're in. And this is what they are. Brackets for the seats. Next, that would be to get these in place or mocked up so I can mark them. Need to poke a hole. Nice quality brackets. I'll post a link in the description where I got them from Rose Fabrication. I believe he's scraping pavement on YouTube. I'll start off on this side by cutting that hole. Side, the seat almost follows the same path as this bracket. Almost. I'll take the seat back out and switch the brackets around because those are interchangeable with this side and it'll give me this extra width on the outer ends. So I kind of got an idea of what I need to do. All right, I got them flipped. Oh, here's the plan. Remove these four mounting brackets and mount the rail directly to the adapters. I think that should work. Got all new hardware for the seat brackets. 
and then I just drilled some holes and bolted the 350Z frame rails to the universal brackets. I have a block here to adapt, but I'll get some square tubing and replace it. That board was a good idea, but it would have still needed a spacer and the 350Z rails was touching the brackets anyways. So I just utilized that. Use what I had. The driver's side is mounted the same way as the passenger side minus the wood block. I didn't need that. They're solid and way better than that stock beef seat. Later on, I'll take them out and I'll redo the carpet, build a little center console and clean them up. Now that the seats are installed, I'm gonna perform the kick test. I didn't make this up. I saw some seats being installed on Rice Truck on YouTube. I'll post a link to the video I got it from. And I think these are gonna pass. Test out this side. Yeah, those things aren't going anywhere. I, I wish I could take credit for making this up. Before bolting the stock bracket to the road universal brackets, I thought about cutting the seat brackets off and mounting the rails directly to the road brackets. Then I came up with a better idea was mounting some flat bore to the rails and then mounting the flat bore to the road brackets. But I kept it simple and realized it was best just to mount the seat brackets directly to the road brackets. This wasn't a how-to, this was how I did it. I don't weld or have any fabrication skills, so I did it the best way I thought I could. And it's good enough for me. I got a nice set of seats, or once they clean, they'll be nice. And they feel way better than those bench seats. Yeah.